We're here at the Museum of Skurium in southern Denmark, where there's certain artifacts of the mythical world. Can it all be true? Let's find out. Pan away, pan away! Yes, this isn't your boring old museum of fossilised dinosaur turds. This museum has all the obscure mythical beasts of your wildest fantasies. I'm talking goblins, ghouls, Goths! Um, no, Goths are real, Tom. <laughs> okay, yeah, sure thing, Jeremy. Anyway, it's safe to say that this house has some of the weirdest artefacts in the world. The guy who owned this house had a serious fascination with the occult. And no, we're not talking about Yakult, which is very good for your digestive system. Mm. We're talking about the occult, which is, if anything, worse for your digestive system. And <laughs> <laughs> there is one thing he did make, and it kind of goes like this. Secret tunnel! Secret tunnel! Through the mountain! A uh, bookcase. But it's actually a bookcase. That's right. Although it may look like we've just wandered into Marilyn Manson's garage, this museum is actually the former home of an eccentric 19th century collector named Cornelius Rhoda. He kept all of his supernatural relics locked away in a secret room. Secret tunnel! Yep, sorry me. Secret tunnel. Which was finally unearthed in 2017. You can tell he really likes werewolves and vampires. It's just a shame he died a hundred years before he could read Twilight. Werewolf? Werewolf. Do you know what? He's not that big. Moving right. Was that me? Was that me who made that happen? Is it coming alive? It's definitely moving. Where are you going? Why are you leaving me? <laughs> <laughs> Although, you can never be too careful. You should always be prepared for a potential night at the museum situation. Look, if he tries anything funny... <laughs> He's smoking, he's smoking. Nice skull. I bet they were so handsome in real life. That's their skull. Apparently every time you say, I don't believe in fairies, a fairy dies. So do you think there was just like a mass extinction of like one dick just going, I don't believe in fairies, I don't believe in fairies, Stop I don't believe in fairies, it. I don't believe in fairies, Stop I don't believe in fairies. Which one's the evil's one? Pixies. We don't like pixies, we do like fairies. Well, pixies were a good band. Yeah. And they deserve to be put in a cage like this. Looks like a skull. Actually, two kids. Quite wholesome. Actually, it's actually saying where your life goes to die is in parenthood. Wow, subtext. Cool. <laughs> Thanks for watching Jason Tonight, bro. <laughs> this museum really is ancient. I don't think I've seen a person under 80 eat licorice all sorts. Speaking of food, I am slightly worried someone swapped their spell book for a cookbook. Hello. Salt on the windowsill, nothing's coming in. Nice. It's a bit of cinnamon. Just that's just for the, that's just for us. You know, that's okay. just to spruce the place up a bit. Yeah, yeah. Smell a bit nice. Everyone loves pumpkin spice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Passage, rosemary, and thyme. Where's the garlic? That's a good point. <laughs> I don't like it. What's that? Well, it looks like a sacrifice is about to happen. Maybe we are the sacrifice. Oh, look at that. This is so creepy. That is real creepy, isn't it? Really don't like having my back to that. Yeah. The devil's gonna get summoned. El Diablo's coming out. Well, as you, uh, I heard you wanna be, you wanna get a million subscribers on YouTube. Well, I've got a nice little deal for you. 10 mil for half your soul. Half my soul? I'll keep mine. I'd literally wait till my testicles. I think it's your <laughs> turn to do something crazy. I have a good soul. So, I don't wanna tell <laughs> It's you. worth more than 10 mil. Yeah. <laughs> and the door's shut behind me. Not funny. Hello! <laughs> gotcha! Go on, you little devil! <laughs> Tarot card reading. And somebody's leftover biscuits. <gasps> oh my god! That's fucked, man. Fuck. That's messed up. That's mythical. Why would you leave a plate of biscuits and only eat half of one? Oh god! Yeah, that's okay. There's more. <gasps> oh, this is so okay. creepy. Alright, Jess. Yep. Coming off them? No, I just got here with you. Oh yeah. Um, so I'm going to do a tarot reading for you today. The Magician. Now, that's someone in your life who's more of a sort of creative attacking midfielder. That's me. I am known as the Magician. Are these tarot readings just purely related to football? Knight of the Wands. Now, our wand is very much like our camera, our vlog camera. So, again, that's me. What we've established is I'm a magician on the pitch and off the pitch. Now, this is this is... tarot reading for me? Yeah, 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 yeah. Now this is a forest, and these are sticks. Think about that. Now this man here, <laughs> now this man here, that's you. You love a star. You surround yourself by stars. That's why you surround yourself with the magician, who's me. Pace of cups, that's because you love playing beer pong and flip cup. Now this is the interesting one. More of a ring of fire guy. The devil. Okay. Now you've just sold your soul to the devil. Have I? 
Have you just sold my soul to the devil? Yeah, don't worry about it. It's <coughs> small print. You'll get the contract through very soon. Okay, the chariot. Now that means we're gonna be bloody stars. Jeremy, you hear that? What's a chariot yeah. got to do with that? Do you know how to read tarot cards? No, that was all bullshit. Oh, so just like real tarot cards? Yeah, pretty, pretty <laughs> much, yeah. In this museum, they have lots of things, including the, bo the body of a blood-sucking vampire. Oh, my uh, ex-girlfriend's here. <laughs> Due to the nature of Jez and Tom, we're always on the go. Luckily for us, that's why we have the travel Ouija board. No matter where you go, let your Ouija flow. Do you know how to use one? <laughs> that doesn't mean you know, that means the ghost does. Ghost, <laughs> do you not not know us? Work out what I got him with a double negative. No? Did do you say you not, not not know us? So that means, no, that means he doesn't know us. No, because he does. But not not means the first, the no cancels out the first not, so then there's one not, so he does not know us. You possessed Sorry. or you no, just No, I'm just, just trying to figure out the double literature. negative. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Subscribe, okay. Oh my god. Number two. J E. Oh my god. Wow. Z. This, is this ghost dyslexic? They're really struggling here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> A M D. <laughs> T O. Looks like it's going for M. What the fuck? What the fuck? Subscribe to Jez and Todd. I, I told you not to worry about Todd, but. Who the hell we still is Todd? Make, we, we make good videos. Excuse me? <laughs> Todd? I'd flip this table if they weren't in a museum. If there wasn't a ghost museum, sitting right there. <laughs> Unbelievable. You think you know a guy and all of a sudden Todd's in the picture <laughs> making a sweet YouTube channel. M for Tom. Right, goodbye. As Jez left the museum and I got the ghost to send a cease and desist to Todd, we were back on the road. Join us next week where we find out which creature left me like this. Ah! Ah! Oh God, God. <laughs>